I'd love to get to a point where we no longer need to talk about women in business, women in rugby, women in this, that and the other, where it's just us doing what we do and doing it well. If I was going to ask for one change over the next five years, I think it's for the current women to start looking after each other a lot more. Equality, diversity isn't something I have to do, but it's something that is just part of who I am, who we are. Yes. More employers understanding the role of women in companies and giving them more senior roles. More parity in terms of pay and an opportunity. To open the doors wider for women. For us to not to have to have a conversation about being a woman in business. <laughs> I'd like women not to be called women in business in the next five years, and I think it may not happen in the next five years, but by the time I have granddaughters, I hope that women in business will be regarded in the same way as we regard the suffragette. The biggest change I'd like to see is, is women just going for it more. There's so much opportunity out there, no one has ever said you can't. I would love to see women much more confident about getting to parity, not apologizing or worry that being equal in all measures is a radical request. 50% of the population, but only 37% of global GDP is not an acceptable starting point. It's a loss for women, it's a loss for men. I would like to see that women are taken off the agenda for the right reasons. Uh, it's no longer there because of the objectives have been met. I know from my own personal experience and from my business that we have very few female engineers. And I'd really like to see that change over the next five years at every level of their career. I'd like to see more women on boards. I think it's brilliant that women play such an important role in the workplace. There to be more women at board level, more women in parliament, but there because of their merit and not because they're on a quota. I'm really looking forward to the time that we don't have to talk so much about what it's like being a woman in the business and we just get to talk about what the business is like and what it's like running the company. There's still some way to go, but I certainly feel at the moment that we seem to be on the right path. We have a huge advantage being a minority, so we might as well milk it while we can.